Hey everyone, welcome back to another Lego review. This is the Lego Castle review, set number 70401, the Castle Gold Getaway. Now this is the second smallest set from the Castle Wave that came out in 2013. Retails for about $20 with 199 pieces and three minifigures. So let's start by looking at the good guys here. We get this guy with a, you know, kind of that conical shaped armor hat, single printed face. He's carrying a, I guess it's some sort of ax type weapon. I don't know what, what the official name is. And he's wearing kind of a, a loin, shirt with some belts going across nothing printed on the legs and a little bit of printing on the back so that's one one good guy the other good guy is holding a shield with a blunt tipped sword and the kind of visor type what looks like something that you would see in a um, like a ninjago type set some sort of visor headgear but it's clearly metal the way they've got those rivets on there so some sort of metal visor headgear printed armor on the front and back nothing on the legs and we've got a kind of stern face and it's a single printed face so that's good guy number two and our bad guy is the carriage, I guess, I don't know, driver. So he's carrying a cool little axe, and it's the, the kind that's clipped onto the brown, brown rod. And he's got the, the whip to whip the horse. He's got the printed armor on the front, nothing on the legs. A little bit on the back, actually a lot on the back. And then he's got his mean face. Nothing on the back. Single printed face. Cool little armored headgear. I like these a lot better than the, the good guys. So let's look at the model here. So the good guys, they basically have... This little crossbow looking flick fire contraption. And it kind of looks like a crossbow the way it the way it bows out here. You know, imagine pulling pulling it back and then releasing it. But it's just aesthetics. It it all all you can do is really just push the flick fire out. But I, I imagine it's a crossbow. So I guess here's the way it plays out in the the first little set, the the forest ambush. They they steal the treasure chest from the, the good guys, and somehow it gets gets onto this carriage, and um, so the good guys step back in and they're trying to intercept the carriage, which it comes with this little auxiliary stone structure, but it really does doesn't have a point at all to it. It just kind of sits back there. There's no no flick fires, no nothing on it. It's just a stone structure. So that's pretty boring. Let's look at the horse here. This is one of the newer style horses that has the legs that can go up. So the horse is pulling this carriage it's got a nice little attachment here. I wish they would have made these, or I mean, they make them in black, but I wish they would have put black ones in the set so it would match the, the horse. That's my only complaint about the, the attachment here. I guess you can imagine that it's a strap going over the horse. So. The horse is cool. 
and then you have this little what looks like a prisoner transporter type carriage that's also carrying treasure chest full of treasure so here's what's kind of interesting about the carriage some sort of prisoner transport it has a printed one by one flat tile lock so that lock is a printed piece on there and then you can see it's chained on there so the the, the play feature is you know the the good guy intercepts the transporter and there's a little technic pin back here that you can push and when you push it you'll see that it releases the chain and the transporter then becomes open so rather than unlocking the lock you more or less just break the chain open so you, it's you know it's a stretch on the imagination but I could see it kind of working and the chains all crooked now there we go so that's it it's it's a small little set like I said only 199 pieces this thing back here is pointless the crossbow is okay it's essentially just a glorified flick fire the carriage is nicely designed the horse is is pretty cool it would have been better if maybe they had two horses and got rid of this thing uh, other than that maybe another bad guy you know two horses and a bad guy or two horse and a bad guy and get rid of that thing so it's pretty cool so we're going to drop it make sure to check out our our speed build of this set and um catch our next little review thanks for watching oh make sure to hit the thumbs up like this video please thumbs up all of our videos that you watch that helps us a bunch later